I'm, I have diabetes. We don't know what's happening with the pandemic. Like the curve's going up, the curve's going down. We're flattening it. Are we going out? Are we not? We didn't know. We're trying to be as cool as we can and stay safe, right? And then I start getting these emails from the doctor's office. And they're like, if you have a fever, if you lost your sense of taste or smell, stay home. Drink plenty of fluids. New York cares. Be well, be better, be safe. I'm like, stay home? You're the doctor's office. What do you mean stay home? And then I understood why all these people were flying to Hawaii. They couldn't go to the doctor's office, but a round trip flight to Hawaii was $45. <laughs> and if I want to die, I want to do it with a Mai Tai in my hand as well. But the do I couldn't believe the nerve of the doctor's office, right? It's like, what you, you're the, where am I supposed to go? Like, do you think I like coming here once a year so you can make me get on the scale against my will and tell me that number? <laughs> Guys, like, getting on the scale for a woman is like the number of sexual partners that I've had. <laughs> With time, that number never goes down. It's not something that I feel great about, okay? If you tell me, all right, like, I don't want to know. It's nobody else's business. And if anyone asks, the number is the same. It's five, okay? <laughs> I hate that's such a stupid thing. Like, some guys are like, oh, what's your body count? Would you, would you make? I was like, I was in quarantine for 90 days. I never had the desire to pull out a legal pad and a pen and start making a list of every person that I dated. And even if I did, like, I don't remember these people. Like, it would look like the credits to a horror film, okay? <laughs> Guy with the eye patch. <laughs> Third drummer in the band. <laughs> Bus boy at Caroline's. 